And some big news just into us. Chinese President Xi Jinping spoke with Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky by phone this morning. Chinese state media reporting Xi is focused on peace and pushing for a ceasefire as soon as possible. China reportedly also will send a special representative to Ukraine to conduct talks. President Zelensky tweeted about the call just a short time ago calling it long and meaningful. And, John, this is the first time the two have spoken since Russia invaded Ukraine over a year ago. Yeah, it's a significant moment and one the U.S. has been pushing for for a while now. We've heard uh, from President Biden, as well as uh, some of his European counterparts, urging Xi Jinping to finally talk to Zelensky. Zelensky has made the case that if he understands really what's going on here, that he might more side with us and, and depart from his current stance of this friendship with Putin uh, and, and Russia. And now let's recall, though, she did host Putin uh, you know, recently and visited Moscow not long ago uh, as well. So this is not that. But it's potentially a step. We know China has put forth a peace plan that the Ukrainians have rejected outright, saying it's unrealistic because it would codify Russia's gains there. Uh, but as pressure mounts to try to find some sort of diplomatic solution to this this battle, uh, potentially after Ukraine's counteroffensive, uh, this is a step in the in the right direction. We'll see what it yields and if China is going to change its stance to Moscow. They have not supplied lethal aid, but the U.S. has been clear that Beijing has been helping Moscow all along, at least economically, during this invasion. So